Okay, so this video is going to explain how I play um, my cover of Free by Cody Simpson. I want to thanks to the users, one here on YouTube and another one on Instagram, that request me to do this tutorial. So, yeah, this is my first one tutorial, so hope everything works well. Okay, for the song by Cody, um, we have a little intro that have a little riff so I'm going to explain it in four parts the first one will be this the second one is this the third one and the fourth one Okay, so it's not as complicated as it looks. Um, first of all, we're going to begin with a bar on the 6th fret. And then we're going to do two hammer-ons. One on the 5th string on the 8th fret and another one on the 4th string on the 8th fret. So we have this. Okay, and then we're going to do a pull-off on the 4th string. So we have this. Then we're going to play the 5th string on the 8th fret and we're going to make a slide to the 6th fret and then we're going to put another bar on the 4th fret and play the 5th string. So we have this, the hammer, the hammer, the pull off, then we're going to play the 5th string on the 8th fret, the slide and the bar. Okay. So slowly we have this. Okay. Remember the slide um, from the eighth fret on the fifth string to the sixth fret. Okay. And just to finish, we're going to put this chord. We have the bar on the fourth fret, and then we're going to put our three fingers on the second, third, and fourth string on the sixth fret. Okay, so the first part will look like this. Okay, then we're going to strum without sound on um, there. Here, we're going to. Okay. Okay, we're going to strum without sound one down and two up just to change and to the second part so we have the first part hammer on the fifth hammer on the fourth pull off on the fourth we play the fifth the slide and the squirt okay so we have this remember to strum without sound so we have this Again, one more time. Okay, then we're going to pass to the second part of the riff. Um, we're going to play the beginning as the first part. But now we're going to leave our finger on the fifth string on the sixth fret. In the first part, we we play like this. In this part, we're going to play it with this. So we have the second part. Okay. And then we're going to complete the chord putting our middle finger on the third string on the fifth fret. Okay. So we have this. Sorry. Okay. And then we're going to strum again without sound. Okay. Down up. In the first part we strum down up up and here in this part we're going to play down up. Okay. And that is the second part. For the third part we're going to um play pre we're going to play first the hammer on on the 4th string on the 8th fret. So we have this. Mm -hmm. 
First, we're going to play it to make the hammer on. And then we're going to play it again to make the pull up. Okay. 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 After that, after that, we're going to make a slide on the fifth string. Uh, from the 8th fret to the 6th fret ok ok and then we're going to put another bar on the 4th fret and we're going to play the 5th string and we're going, and we're going to make a slide um, from the 4th fret to the 6th fret playing the 5th string so we have this the hammer, the pull off, the slide and the other slide and then we're going to play another chord you made this chord um, with the bar on the 6th fret with your middle finger on the second string on the seventh fret and with those two fingers on the third and the fourth string on the eighth fret okay so we're going to play here um six six eight eight seven six So these are the this is the third part of the intro. Okay. Okay. We're going to strum down and then we're going to strum up and stop the sound. Okay, you don't need to put your finger But it sounds well, as you can see Okay, so that's the third part And then for the last part of the intro, we're going to play this We're going to begin as the third part But now instead of do a slide from the 4 to the 6 we're going to make a hammer on on the fifth string. Uh, we have the bar on the fourth fret, and we're going to make a hammer on on the sixth fret. So we have this. And then we're going to finish the part doing a slide from the from this on the sixth fret on the fifth string to the one fret. To the first fret and we're going to play it again so we have this and we're going to put this chord and it's an A major chord we have the bar on the second fret we have our middle finger on the third string on the third fret and we have these two fingers on the 4th and the 5th string on the 4th fret ok so for this last part of the intro we have this we're going to strum down and then another off fast and stop so we have this ok and then we're going to play this last part of the intro this ok so I play on the 6th string uh, the 4th fret and the 6th fret so we have 
then we're going to play on the fifth string on the fourth fret we're going to play it twice okay then we're going to play again the sixth string on the sixth fret and then we're going to return again to the fifth string on the fourth fret so we have this okay so that's all the intro um, and then we're going to play this part I'm not pretty sure if this is correct but I play it like this and I think it's worth it so you're going to put uh, you're going to play the second string on the ninth fret and then you're going to make a hammer on and a pull off on the 11th fret okay you're going to play that after play this okay uh, this is faster but I'm going to explain you with this is lovely okay and so that's all the intro and now you're going to repeat it again but now you're not going to play the first part you're going to begin with the second part so we have sorry the second the third and the fourth and now instead of and only with the fifth string on the fourth fret we're going to finish with the first chord that is here okay I explained you before it's a bar on the fourth fret and with these three fingers on the second the third and the fourth string on the sixth fret so we have this okay then we're going to play uh, we're going to strum without sound up down up down okay so we have this then we're going to play again the same chord and we're going to strum again without sound but now down up so we have down okay uh, one more time okay remember is down up down up the chord again and then down up okay um, so well with this we finish with the intro and now we're going to begin with the verse um, I need to say that the verse and the chorus is exactly the same you're going to play the second verse as you play the first verse and you're going to play the chorus and the second chorus and the third chorus playing exactly the same as you play in the verse so we have four chords um, the first one is what I explained you before the bar on the four and with these three fingers on the second, third and fourth string on the sixth fret the second chord we're going to keep the bar on the fourth fret and we're going to put our middle finger on the third string on the fifth fret and these two fingers on the fourth and the fifth string on the sixth fret this is our second chord for our third chord we're going to move the bar from the fourth to the sixth and then we're going to move our fingers one string down so our middle finger will stay on the second string on the seventh fret and these two fingers on the third and the fourth string on the eighth fret. Okay, so we have this chord. 
and our last card will be on the uh, we're going well well um this is a this is an F major chord so we have our bar on the second fret and our middle finger on the third string on the third fret and with these two fingers on the fourth and the fifth string on the fourth fret okay so that's our four chord that we're going to use for the verse and the chorus alright so now we're going to see the strumming the strumming is a little difficult to explain but I'm going to do my best um, so yeah we have this the the end is we're going to play the second the second chord okay um, so this is basically um, this we're going to strum down stop the sound we're going to play without sound strum down okay then we're going to strum two times up and then we're going to strum down but only on the six four six fifth and fourth string and then we're going to make a full strum down okay so we have this strum down stop without sound and up up down down then we're going to stop the sound again and play an up strum okay this is so this is this is this right okay and yeah that's the strumming pattern so we have this okay okay and then we're going to change to the other string to the other chord sorry and the strum again the same we're going to jump to the bridge the bridge is simple um, so we have this and then you're going to play down 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 okay you have this chord on the with the bar on the fourth fret and the, our middle finger on the third string on the fifth fret and these two on the fourth and the fifth string on the sixth fret, so we, so we're going to move uh, the chord only one fret up. So we have this. We're going to move it to the third fret and then to the second fret. It's simple. Okay, and here we're going to return to the strumming pattern. to move to this to this chord but then we're going to play like this down up up and return okay so we have this okay and then we're going to return again to the strumming pattern And then we're going to play down 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 and this is the beginning for the chorus um, in this part I play a part 
that is not in the song or call it on play like this but I play it like this to give it my own style so I play it like this okay for play like this finishing with the fourth strumming down I move the chord to the 15th fret and then I'm going and then I put a bar on the six on the sixteenth fret okay and then I strum and I up it and I take it to the fourth fret again. So it's like this okay just to begin with the chorus as I told you before the chorus is exactly the same as the bars so we're going to have this with the same strumming pattern okay and yeah now when once you finish the, with the chorus you're going to play again the same part of the intro on the riff but again without the first part so you have the finish of the chorus she just wanna be free and you're going to play again the second part the third the fourth and yeah you will finish with the riff and you're going to begin with the verse again but now you're not going to play the bridge you're going to jump from the verse to the chorus so you're not going to play this part okay you will you're going to jump from the verse to the chorus and when you finish again with the chorus you're going to play again the same riff you're going to play again the same riff okay um yeah you're going to play it twice again without the first part to you know the rest and um, but now when you finish with i think it's the third time that you play it you're going to have this and you're going to jump to the bridge Okay, so we have this. Okay, only play it like this. Down, up, up. Okay, and then down, 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 down. And we return to the chorus. Okay, and then you're going to finish with the chorus and you're going to play again the riff from the intro. Um, again, you're going to not play the first part of the riff. So you're going to begin again with the second part. And yeah, this is the last part of the song. Now when you finish, you have this. <laughs> Okay, just to make the end of the song. Um, yeah, so for the finish, you have this. You're going to finish with the string and then up. Then you're going to up it to the zero to the zero fret. Sorry. And then you're going to stop the sound with your other fingers. Okay? Okay? So, that's all the tutorial. That's how I play my cover of free. If you want to see my video cover, just check my videos. And yeah. Um, hope this is helpful for you. 
And if you have more requests for songs or tutorials, please let me know. As I told you, I have a request here on YouTube and on my Instagram. So, if you want to request, just let me know in the comments on this video or in other videos. Or let me know the song you want on my Twitter or in my Instagram. I leave my I leave my user on every video I made. So yeah, that's how you play free by Cody Simpson. Thank you so much for watching.